Hi friends, I'm Megaloceros giganteus, extinct about 7,700 years ago. True to my name, I had these enormous antlers. Unfortunately, these very antlers I was so proud of led to our extinction. Would you like to hear about what happened back then? Please go ahead. First, let me tell you about these impressive antlers. Only males had them, with a width of 3 meters and a weight of 45 kilograms. You're wondering if they got in the way. Of course they did. The antlers made it difficult to drink water or eat grass. It was quite stressful, but the bigger they were, the more attractive I was to females. To win over my beloved females, I had to defeat other males in battles, so I wished for it. I wished for my antlers to grow stronger, harder, and bigger. But then, their growth far exceeded my expectations. They took so much calcium that my bones didn't get enough nutrients. And these antlers, they shed every year. Because of that, my bones became weaker and weaker. What a disaster! Moreover, the forests were shrinking and food became scarce, which was a critical hit. I started fracturing bones easily, so I couldn't move freely. Is this what despair feels like? I'm done trying to be attractive. Someone just free me from these antlers. Ah, just strained myself talking about it, and now there's a crack in my bone. It hurts, so I'm going to rest now. Take care. As Megalocris Giganteus explained, his enormous antlers drained nutrients like calcium and phosphorus needed for his body, leading to brittle bones and extinction. I wish we could have given them plenty of milk to drink. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. See you in the next video.